assalamu alaikum welcome back to my youtube channel biological science and statistics right today we will perform an example from book uh, chapter 8 fractional factorial design and uh, for the, the theoretical part of this uh, topic i will explain in another video you can watch that and uh, here I, we will just perform the practical point of view how we can perform the fractional factorial and i just want to mention one thing that in fractional factor factorial we just take the half of values right we perform half of the experiment and get similar results as for full factorial uh, suppose we have eight different treatment combinations but we will perform four of these and we will get the similar results as we perform it as for saving of your uh, uh, material for performing experiment right. here in example we have uh, five different factors each has level 2 and uh, 2 raised to power uh, 2 raised to power 5 minus 1 it means we want to take the half of this value if here is the value 2 raised to power 5 minus 2 then we take the quarter of this treatment combination right 2 raised to power 5 we will have 32 combinate treatment combination but 2 raised to power 5 minus 1 then we take 16 according to fra fractional factorial we will take uh, 16 different treatment combination rather 16, uh, 32 okay we have five different factors a b c and d and e right and these are treatment combinations that we take uh, we take these treatment combination based upon uh, the plus minus signs the matrix according to matrix design the plus minus signs of a b c d uh, which are displayed in uh, chapter number six table 6.11 right, for four factors and if you want to perform for five factors then you can uh, draw the matrix for five factors factorial and then we will select uh, you can select the positively sign values the treatment combinations which fall in with positive sign in a b c d e right here these are the values six they are select in the book earlier to me and uh, then we will perform it these values on spss first we have the description of variables response and five different factors and each has two different levels right and this we will uh, for response we have scale and factor a b c d we will mention them as a nominal here's a data view and these are the response values 8 9 34 52 these values are over here all right free it means uh, when we enter the data on spss the signs negative show the low level and positive shows high level right on SPSS the four different has low levels and one has high level for eight similarly you can see in book these are four different negative signs and one is positive sign for value E eight right in the same way the data has been entered on the SPSS the critical thing is data entry be focused and try to understand how the data has been entered you can see the zero one sign as well zero for low level and one for high level and then we go towards analyze and general linear model is a univariate analysis right and uh, response factor a b and c d and e are come in fixed factor then we go towards the model okay i want to mention one thing again that i want to compare my result with books so i will take just the value which are taken in the books uh, for comparison just right they have taken factor a factor b factor a and b 
factor C. Right. You can take values other than these as per your requirements, as per the treatment combination that you have. You can select from these. Uncheck this one and continue. Go towards options, take all of these. Display mean descriptive statistics and continue. And okay. It shows that we didn't take the value for factor E, factor D, and factor E. It's, it's okay that we as we want to compare results with books only. That's why I didn't take. If your experiment have requirement to take these values, you have to take them. Okay. And is the NOVA table. All right. I'll just compare the results with book. It's, a, it's just a practical demonstration how we can perform the fractional factorial on SPSS. All right. You can see the model for factor A, we have 495, factor B, 4590, the similar values, 473 for factor C, and A, B, 189, and the error for 28. Okay, and I have to explain the, the table that all of these factors have significant effect factor A, significant effect factor B, factor C, significant effect, there is significant effect of fact interaction AB as well. I hope you have enjoyed the video and, and uh, that video is will be a value addition in your knowledge. And thank you for watching. Subscribe and like my channel for new coming videos and press the bell icon. Share with your colleagues for learning. And I hope uh, you will understand what I have shared. If you have any difficulty, please comment or contact with me for further clarification. Thank you. Allah